Welcome back to Space Engineers and uh, finally managed to build something. The lights are lagging, this is what I uh, noticed. Uh, I don't know if these lights specifically but if you like have headlights and these spotlights they do lag and drop your frame rate. But anyway, this is my control room. That's a reactor room. Uh, Two of the lights are gone. I don't know what happened. There were two green lights in there. But anyway, it looks pretty cool. That's my main control room. It's a medical station. Here's some uh, small storage room. I'll first show you the ship. And then I will show you how you can build. It seems complicated, but it's really easy. And I have uh, several decks. First, we're gonna go on top, which is in here. There's my uh, beacon, Death Walker Gateway. <laughs> Here's some observation decks, and from here we can get to the antenna rays in case they break. We can get to these, and here you can get some overview of it. There's the beacon can get to the beacon from here. I'll just close this door and go down from here. Here's another door for the beacon. Some solar panels. Uh, this, uh, that's just target practice. That's the other section. And there's some more solar panels in there. And I just um, go from into... I could just fly, but I'll just show how the ship I mean the gateway looks from inside and this is the staircase in here where we get into the main part these reactors are making horrible noises there's nice uh, walk walk down uh, this is pretty empty I haven't really done anything here's the airlock that leads to the hangars and here is uh, another observation area which is pretty awesome Again, the lights have disappeared. I don't know what's going on. That's a rather big observation area. And going back. Uh, I should put the door in here. Here we have some windows. You can observe in here. And that's the other part of the ship. That's not completely even completed. I know this door is open. There's some, I don't know, some office room maybe. And here is, uh, what is, uh, I can't remember, assembler, that's what it is. And you can also access from here. Refineries are there, big ones. There's another gravity generator, because the range is too small for one of them. And from here, we can get into the airlock for the solar panels. See, here's the solar panel array. And I have stripes on it. I was just testing out the colors, which I will show you shortly. Uh, let's go back. Back to the other section. And yeah, it automatically saves. It's a rather long walk. Or run. And here we can go this section. I don't believe I showed you this. There's a big reactor in there. I'll just go down there for a second. Again, I've got the door open. That's the big reactor. Get out of here. You can get lost in here. <laughs> and that's the airlock I wanted to show you. Which leads to the hangars.
And here we are in the hangar. Apparently can't jump over it. And that's red. So the pilots can see it better. Why is this open again? And here's one of my ships. Here's a warhead. Not a gravity generator. There are small turrets in here. In the corners. And that's my small ship which doesn't have a name. I'll just show you how it flies. It's a rather fast ship. It's very good acceleration. And that's how it looks uh, from outside which is pretty huge. That's the observation area in there. And this ship in here, I just found it. It's like one of these random spawns. It was just uh, flying around like this mining transport. Could test out my weaponry on it, but... I will show you how these weapons work on that mining transport. I'm gonna fly my way up there. Alright, getting closer. Open fire. These are the random spawns, I don't think it actually starts shooting at me. Did I already break it? No, I didn't. can actually steal them. Fuck did it go? There we go. Take out the beacon. And once the beacon's gone, as you can see the name disappears and you no longer see it on the radar. Pretty awesome space combat. <laughs> also, um, building. Well, I think it's destroyed. I could just mess around with it longer, but I'll go back to base and I'll show you the building. Right, the first thing which you can do is uh, press G, assuming that you haven't changed the default controls. That opens this kind of menu. And depending on what you want to build, if you want to build a station, large ship or small ship. Let's build a new station. And this is where the station starts. You just select a spot and just press left mouse click. That's it. And the next important thing, now you can attach stuff to it, but next important thing, press escape. Go to options, game. And this is very uh, important. Single block, well, it's obvious line it should also be obvious that it just draws big lines I'll show you how it works this is very important when building then you select whatever you want like heavy armor block I'm in creative mode so uh, I have infinite resources you just move your mouse in here and now I press and hold left mouse button and that's where the line is basically goes really far away and wherever you want it, you just uh, let it go. There you go. And I will show you what the plane mode is. It's basically really good if you building. Plane mode, for example, from corner to corner. It's like this. You can easily build all that. And to delete all this, you just right click and do the same thing. You just have to move a little bit around it. And we delete the whole thing, see. That's basically how you build, it's very easy. You just open this menu. Uh, what you need is like gravity generator, if you want the gravity to be enabled. 
and that's how you build everything like all these lights and everything and the gravity generator can be controlled either from here you just highlight and press K and that highlights the specific gravity generator you can turn it off or even to minus then you just go upside down <laughs> but that's all you have to do and this is the whole ship controls you can turn around the ship like this or the station or whatever it is well I'm gonna show you a full tutorial on how to build a small base and I'll do it real quick as fast as possible uh, whoops I don't want controls uh, first I'm gonna use it as a plane mode and we're gonna build it out of the heavy blocks in here uh, first whoops new station put it in here a little bit away from it you can delete this block later whoops um, I'll build a really small one something like this uh, delete that one uh, so we put um, something like this you can see it's very easy to build with this plane mode. Just have to uh, master it, the angles and stuff. And uh, don't worry that there are no windows. We'll make these soon. Uh, so that's uh, done. We're gonna make a small landing platform in here. That's where the door is gonna be. Uh, so we need a door first. Uh, doorway is here uh, Move this in there uh, As you can see these buttons delete page down page up. Uh, you can see it in the cube on the corner Right and we have a door now. Let's put a few windows in here uh, Windows we put uh, you can have different windows, but I'll just use the simple ones And also you have to rotate them. Let's put a few of them Maybe like, uh, whoops, uh, one on each side. It's not symmetrical or anything, but I'm not trying to. I'll just uh, show you how to build a quick base, that's all. Maybe you can have two windows in here. Whoops, uh, that's not what I wanted to do. That's okay, we just put another block in there. Right, now that we have our entrance, we need, um, we need a power generator. Uh, small reactor, gravity generator, and we need a console, which is uh, maybe mm, medical room, but it can come later. So we go in here. Uh, there is no gravity right now, so that's why the door doesn't open. I forgot that. See, I have to go in like this because there is no reactor. That's why the door doesn't open. Put the reactor in in that corner. And that's the gravity generator. And as you can see, as soon as I put it down, you can walk in here. And the console we put um, in here. Now I can put this block back. And that's how you build a base. That's a basic base. Uh, we can also have lights. Uh, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Let's put a few lights. There we go. See? And in the console, you can look at it. And you can also press K and you can um, change the light colors. That's how you change the light colors. For example, let's change this to blue and make it a little bit more intense see but the only problem is with these you don't know which one it is so if you build a base name your stuff see this light is the door light you can see that this door and whoops I just wanted to close the menu see that's the door light then you know what it is whoops but with the doors if you press K on that it automatically takes you to the right door and you can put um, like entrance uh, one in here you can also open and close it from here 
and everything else works the same way like the reactor if you press K in here you get instant in here in case you have like many reactors in your base so that's how it works and rest you can just add all the stuff and I'm gonna also uh, show you how to might put one light in there also show you how to add colors for example we're gonna add uh, let's add these things uh, colors you press P and here we can change I'll make these yellow it's like um, the oops, doorway so you won't fall off <laughs> not like it matters I'm just showing you uh, that's because of the light in there I forgot to see that you can't put stuff in there you have to remove the light well they have a lot of work to do because see they need these corner pieces because you can't like make corners but that's just the landing zone that's what I did can land in here but yeah that's how you build it's very easy as you saw I just built it in just uh, within a few minutes probably less I don't really time it but yeah that's how you build it and you can add additional things for example beacon is something you really need uh, where is the damn beacon I see it and maybe solar panels for some let's change solar panel colors let's change it to white and we add like uh, maybe like three solar panels then we add a beacon which could be like there uh, you can rename the beacon whatever you want and antennas I don't even know what they are for which is where the fuck is it there I don't know what it's antenna for but I'll just put it anyway not sure but yeah the beacon you can change uh, I'll show you real quick uh, wait, actually, I think you can rename it up here. Let me try. Something I haven't tried. No, I don't think you can re rename it from there. You have to go into your console. Press T, then press K, and find the beacon, and call it whatever you want. And once done, That's what your house will be called. See, these are the markers like this uh, Dead Walker Gateway. You can have several ones if you want, but... So if you're struggling, then that's how you build. And I'll see you next time.